Hey guys, Triple Nipple Neck here. Welcome to my kitchen. Uh, today, we're going to be unboxing a weird fruit. It's called a, a night owl. It looks a bit like a cantaloupe in texture, but it's not the same shape and it's not the same fruit. So uh, we're just going to get right into this. We're going to start by cutting it in half. I think I'll do it the long way. There we go. Nice and easy. It looks orange inside. I'll uh, show you that. Okay. We're going to set this half to the side. Yeah, you can see that. Very similar to a cantaloupe. It actually um, smells like a cantaloupe too. It's a little weird. We're gonna put that half to the side. We got some here. Just gonna cut out the seeds. Okay, that looks like a, a strip of it. Hopefully you can get a good focus on that. Very juicy, it's dripping on my table as we speak. Well, I think I'll just uh, cut it in half. Put that hat to the side. <clears throat> yeah, I think I'll cut it in half. Put that half to the side. Yes, yeah, let's, let's give this a try. It tastes very similar to cantaloupe. Um, now, in case you were wondering whether or not this is just a cantaloupe, it's actually not. It really is a desert owl. Here's the here's the sticker. I'll put that there for a bit. Make sure it gets a good focus. You can see it's a vine ripened to desert owl. That means they let it ripen on the vine as opposed to picking it before it's ripe and then letting it ripen in the storage process, which you can do with bananas, peaches, many many fruits are fine with that, but some fruits it'll make them um, not ripen properly, and I guess a desert owl is one of those, which is why they're advertising the vine ripen. Now I haven't seen a cantaloupe in this shape ever, so I think uh, the only distinction we can draw between a cantaloupe and a desert owl from this is uh, that oval shape. You know, this this looks more like the earth, whereas um, a cantaloupe is, is a sphere, so. <clears throat> I think I'll cut this up, put some in a Tupperware, eat the rest. Uh, thanks for watching.